do this right before going to sleep to completely change your life. I mean completely, for real. This has to be probably one of my favorite Neville Goddard techniques. Look, you want to manifest more money? You want better health? A loving relationship? You name it. This works. In fact, I still do this every single day. And you should too. Here's why. Because once you start learning about all this manifestation stuff, you'll discover that it's your subconscious mind that runs a show, right? Not your conscious mind. Now, did you know that sleep is a natural door into the subconscious? Yep, sleep is a time when the conscious and the subconscious are creatively joined. So whenever you go to sleep at night, don't ever forget this. Your beliefs, your last waking concept of yourself, listen, will dominate your entire sleep and impress your subconscious, which will then what? Express itself in your outer world. For instance, if you end up assuming the consciousness of success while you're falling asleep, then you'll be successful. But if you end up feeling failure while you're falling asleep, then guess what? That'll follow instead. Remember, your subconscious sees you as you believe yourself to be. Not what you want to be, but what you are, what you feel yourself to be. So whether it be good, bad, or indifferent, your subconscious will faithfully embody your beliefs, your last waking mood right before knocking out. So if your sleeping life, which is one third of your life, right? That's a lot of life. Impacts two thirds of your conscious life, your waking life. Well, then you got to be more intentional of how you fall asleep, folks. Always fall asleep in the state of the wish fulfilled. Never go to sleep feeling discouraged or dissatisfied anymore, you guys. Because again, it'll manifest in your world. Okay, here's how to do it. Here's how to get anything you want using this method. Ready? As you're going to bed, you'll want to lie flat on your back. Okay, and just be relaxed. Immobilize your physical body and induce a state akin to sleep, like a drowsy state where you're half asleep and half awake, but still able to control the direction of your thoughts. You see, being drowsy favors attention without effort. Plus, you're more receptive to suggestion. Ask yourself, how would I feel if my wish were realized? How would I feel? That feeling in response to that question is what you're aiming for. And how would you do that? Imagine it. Close your eyes and go to the end. Imagine your wish fulfilled. It could be any scene that you like, okay? But here's a tip. Condense it. Keep it short and sweet or else you'll lose focus. Restrict your imaginary scene into a single act. For example, you could imagine a friend shaking your hand, congratulating you on your promotion. Feel their hand as solid and real. Or you can imagine your doctor saying to you, a miracle has happened. Hear their excitement in his or her voice telling you the good news. Whatever your desire is, just make the scene as vivid as possible and loop it over and over again until it has a feeling of reality. And then fall asleep in that state, in that assumption. That's it. And then here's what's going to happen. Neville says that your feeling of satisfaction, your feeling of happiness, your mood as you fall asleep, will compel conditions and events to appear in your world. And your desire will be realized because you get what you believe. Yeah. Alrighty, guys. Don't forget to smash that like and subscribe button. Help support this channel. And the bell right next to it to be notified of my next video. I pump these out every single week so you don't want to miss them. If you're listening via podcast, I'd really appreciate a review. It gets more people to discover my work and, of course, I'll spread this message. And yo, don't forget to register for my free online training. That'll seriously help you to start manifesting the life you really want right now. So check it out. The link's in the description. Like I always say, more's coming. Till next time, I'm out. Peace.